What's your go-to slider? Today, we may have a new go-to to put in your tool belt. Your repertoire, your if repertoire. you will, of slider go-tos uh, for game day or otherwise. Another toy to put in your toy box. There you go. If you want to find out how we are knocking out these chili cheese dog sliders, stick around while we dig, dig in. in. We're giving away a griddle. We are going to be giving away a Pit Boss Ultimate 3 Burner or Pit Boss Sierra to one lucky winner. This is anybody who has ordered our book, the Epic Outdoor Griddle Cookbook, which is available on Amazon, Books A Million, and basically anywhere books are sold. There's a link to the description below this video, also a description on how you can win. If you have already pre-ordered, don't worry, you will be included in this as well. All you have to do is send proof of purchase to outdoorgriddle at quarto.com for your chance to be entered in this drawing. A winner will be selected on publication date, which is December 6th. Don't tell anybody else, we want you to win. This is the perfect Christmas gift. Get this for yourself, get this for your griddle lover, or get this to find out why we love griddle cooking. Check out the details below for your chance to win. Good luck. I really am excited for this one. This was another one that I just thought of. I don't know how or why. I guess I have a hankering for a chili cheese dog. And we just happened to get all these King's Hawaiian rolls. We get them in the bulk yep, at Sam's Club. And I thought, man, or did we get these ones at Costco? Who knows? But I just thought, man, we should we should probably we should probably contact. Where's the receipts? Where's the receipts? Show, Show me the receipts. Show me the receipts. <laughs> so regardless, applesauce. regardless of where we got them, it did become the brainchild of this one, and I'm super excited to knock this one out. Brett, get to the groceries. Yeah, here. Well, actually, before we get to the groceries, ah, in case you didn't know, I'm Adam. I'm Brett, and we are the, the Walt Twins. Twins. Now, now it's grocery time. It's grocery time. Here we go. Up front and center, we are using these Nathan's Jumbo Beef Franks. We will be cutting in half. We've got this queso. I love patties. We got Wolf Brand Chili is our chili of choice. This is no beans, and of course, like Adam said, the King's Hawaii. Hawaiian rolls that we put them on. Also, shredded cheddar cheese. And I gotta say, I wanted the chili with beans. It's okay that we got it without. I know when we've done chili dogs in the past, we've been called out one way or the other for using beans in the chili and beans without. We grew up with beans in, so this one happened to be no bean chili. Yeah, and, and so we're gonna get that flavor well, like like a, a hot dog sauce. Yeah, I do wanna clear that up for anyone that says chili doesn't have beans. The one that has key, uh, beans, the can still says chili on it. So I'm, just, <laughs> I'm gonna clear that up right now for, uh, for America. It's all chili for a reason. Yes, right. All right, but let's go ahead and switch angles because we're gonna cut these up and cook them up. This cook's already almost done, really. Yep, it is. All right, so we've done these a few different ways. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just get these cut up. Right now, obviously, we have our amazing utility knife from Dial Strong. My purpose in getting this is because for all the times we try to cut bread or other things, we don't have a good serrated blade. So we got this because you just shoot. Let Am I going all the way through, or are we just opening them you up? Can, uh, you can go all the way through or open up. It doesn't matter. You can just leave them open, and we'll just so long. Yeah, so long oh, as yeah. we can do that because we do want to get some toast on these. Dude, this is like a warm knife through butter. That's what I'm saying because the weight. That's what I love about it. The metal or the the steel is heavy. And so it just carries the blade Dude. right through. Yes, it does. So let's go ahead and bring these on over. We just want to toast these really quickly. Now the middle of the griddle is on and hot. So I'm going to be careful. All right, so while I'm toasting these up, Brett has got the hot dogs. He's going to cut them. So let's do this. Here we go. All right, so I, my thought is I'm going to cut these in half like this. And then using the paring knife, knife from the Quantum series, we absolutely love this. We're going to butterfly these hot dogs. So we're gonna cut down just enough. We don't wanna cut these all the way through, correct, Adam? It's a, uh, no, it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, that's true. They're gonna kind of do their own thing anyway. Mm -hmm. All right, Brett, when those are all butterfly cut open, you can bring them over. Yeah, just go ahead and you can hear that sizzle. The griddle's been on for a little while. It has. A little while that. is being generous. Now, we did debate putting cheddar or um, American, and we went with cheddar. We because love American. of the queso. Yes, and the queso is just a mild cheddar, so this is as well. So we want, is there such thing as too much cheese? No. Nope. Comment below. I've looked it up. <laughs> you looked it up? <laughs> Scientifically proven? Yep. And that's science, so. Can't argue that. Can't argue science. Is that too much cheese, Brett? No. Nope. Again. All right, good couple minutes later. Nice. Try getting the press for this side. What do you think? Oh, yeah. And we're going to apply a little pressure. This is just to keep them flat. Yes, there we go. We'll leave that for a minute. 
After about two and a half to three minutes, so we are oh, done. Show on that other side. side. Nice. So we want to hurry and, and get these on. And we're gonna put a little. See, look, Adam. Look at yes, the size. Sir. Perfect, Perfect size. size. Good call, Brett. I wanted these cut down a little bit. Brett knew what he was doing. I'm gonna turn these over because I like the little avenue. Ooh, look, a little bit of that got stuck there. I'm okay with that. All right, so now, now we're gonna scoop some chili sauce. Look at that. And then we're gonna do the same thing with the sauce. Yep. Look at those. There we go. These oh. are a mess in all the right ways. I like the way that they look messy though. Mm -hmm. That's how you're supposed to eat a chili dog. Yeah, yeah if it doesn't get all over the place, it doesn't belong in your face. It's like a sloppy joe. Yep. And we top them. Ooh. Tell me this just doesn't look fun. Okay, I actually want one even though I don't like hot dogs. <laughs> you're going to love these, I promise you. Uh, this is a gloves on type sitch, Adam. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, there we go. We're oh, gonna get some pictures my. of these. <laughs> And there they are in, in all, all their, their glory. glory. You got a lid coming off there. <laughs> oh, that one's going to drip all over the place. Uh, there's not much to say. Gloves I mean, on. just look. Yeah, glove on type situation. Absolutely. It is a mess. So uh, it's like we were Napkin saying. Napkin on hand type situation too. There like Carl's Jr. adequately said, if it doesn't get all over the place, it doesn't belong in your face. But let's put these in our face. Uh, more than happy Like to we do say, so. they can look amazing. Uh, yeah, they look absolutely they amazing. Do. Like Art. We, like we say, they can smell amazing. Oh, the whole thing smells absolutely <laughs> amazing. Can I get a smell? Yeah. Smell? Yeah, you can. But if it doesn't taste amazing, then this is all, all for not. not. Cheers. Cheers. I'll eat to that, my brother. My brother. Mmm. Mm. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is. Let me. That's it. Oh my gosh. That is so good. I just want more. Mm hmm. It's a chili cheese dog on a Hawaiian roll. I mean, freak. Yeah. This is exactly no, what I you like want. the cheddar better than the cheddar sauce. You don't need this cheddar mm. sauce. I actually wanted the Tostitos cheddar sauce, and I think that would have given a little bit of extra kick, that queso, but I love regardless. It. Yeah, regardless. I know, right? <clears throat> you want one or two bites? Yes, you gotta try this. That Nathan's hot dog. Mm. Mm. Such good know. flavor in that Nathan's hot dog. What do you think, Ken's? Yeah. Ken, she, she doesn't, doesn't like hot dogs. dogs. <laughs> She's over here just munching down on it. She's devoured that one. Yep. Oh, what a hot mess in all the right ways. <laughs> Wasn't kidding, yeah. Kenzie. Kenzie was eating that one up. Let me reset this. It's all over your face. <laughs> I'm, I'm not a mess. You're a mess. <laughs> and the best part, you can just take that cutting board and just mop up whatever you want. To eat. <laughs> so what are your thoughts on the cheese sauce? I like the cheese sauce. The cheese sauce fine. by itself... Um, was, it's actually very mild in flavor. It, it really very, was, really was. Very mild in flavor. I think it went really well with this. I would have liked, honestly, like the, the, the queso that you get, like the melty cheese, the nacho cheese that you get at like football games. Yes. That, that type of cheese on there. And that's why I like perfect. the Tostitos. So I bring that up because I like I like the messiness of it all. I love it. it, it, it looks what, so what am I saying? Look at Kenzie. <laughs> Chili cheese fingers. Well, uh, definitely worth it. We love coming to getting to do these cooks. This one is so much fun. So happy we decided happy to come to do this one. Yeah, this is awesome. This is if great. you like this video, if it gave you an idea of something else you like that you can do on your griddle, make sure and give this video a thumbs up. We really do appreciate it. It's one way in which you can support us what we do. Another way you can support us is through our merchandise. There's a link to that in the description below this video. And don't forget our cookbook, the Epic Outdoor Griddle Cookbook. Yes. Available anywhere books are sold. So excited, so happy. Get it. It's the perfect Christmas gift. Anytime gift or just for you. Get your you deserve a gift. Get That's yourself right. you, epic you. outdoor griddle cookies. Right. Yeah, treat treat yourself. yourself exactly. What is your go-to slider? Make sure and comment that below so we can get a running list of other ideas of cooks <laughs> that we could do because we love getting these ideas. Yeah, we certainly do. So happy we did this one though. Me too. Good As, mood food as always. Aside from coming to knock this banger out, the chili cheese dog slider. Mm -hmm. Why else are we doing this? Because all we do is twin. No, no matter, matter what. what. With that, we bid you adieu. And then don't forget to like and subscribe and griddle on.